Hi guys, welcome to my new After Effects video. In this video, I'm gonna show how to make this animation with Duke Basil 2 and After Effects. Also, this video for beginners. Let's get started. So, vectors from freebie.com, I will add download link and project files. First step, select this background color and background objects. Let's lock layer and select this hand right. Go to solo and let's zoom to layer. Then go to select this puppet pin tool. Let's add one puppet here, one here and one here. Click selection tool and change puppet engine legacy. Click OK. Then go to window, open Duik Basil 2. Then click this icon for go to rigging. And when we selected this puppet engine, click add bones. Okay, we have three puppet pins. Let's link. Select this puppet pin 3. Let's link to puppet pin 2 and select this puppet pin 2. Link to puppet pin 1. And then select this puppet pin 1. Let's link to body. Okay, select the three puppets. Go to do it and click auto rig IK. Okay, we have controller. So let's see, select controller and let's see how to work it. Okay, that's good. Let's unsolo and select these three puppets. Click for hide layers and click toggle switch mode for see here. Click this icon, then click this icon for hide all layers. Then select this hand left, go to solo again and make someone. Go to puppet pin. Let's add one here, one here and one here. Click selection tool, change puppet engine legacy and select puppet. Let's click add bones. Okay, again we have three puppets. Let's link. Select this puppet pin three, link to puppet pin two and select puppet pin two, link to puppet pin one. Then select this puppet pin one. Let's link to body and select the three puppets. Go to do it, click auto rig IK. Okay, we have again controller. Let's select and let's see. Okay, that's good. Let's unsolo again. Select these three puppets. Let's hide layer and click this icon for height. Okay, let's see. Nice, and this controller. Okay, that's good. So select this object and let's link to controller 2, left hand, and select this left controller. Let's see. Okay, and this controller for washing. Nice. So select this body, go to solo, and select palm behind. Let's move to anchor point down. Click selection 2 and unsolo. Select this dead head. Let's link to body let's change this composition name here and select this here go to solo select palm behind move the anchor point down click station tool and unsolo let's press air okay that's good so let's close do it and select this controller right hand let's press p make new position keyframe go to 10 keyframe Let's move to here, go to 10 keyframe again, move to right, 10 keyframe again, move to left. For shortcut, you can use hold shift, press page down in the keyboard for go to 10 keyframe. Again, go to 10 keyframe, let's move to right, go to 10 keyframe again, move to right. Again, go to 10 keyframe, move to left. Let's see. Okay, select keyframes, make easy. Let's say again. Okay, that's good. Select keyframes, full loop animation, control C, go to last keyframe and control V. Again, select keyframes, control C, go to here and control V. Let's go to 6 seconds, press N for select work area and let's select these keyframes, delete. And select this controller, let's go to first second, press P, make new patch in keyframe, go to here, let's move to right, go to here, move to left. 
again got 5k frames moved right and move to left again this is random k frames okay and finally go to here and move to right select k frames make again easy ease. let's see okay not bad so select this body and press air go to here make rotation keyframe frame and go to 5k frames let's chain rotation like this let's see okay go to 5k frames make rotation again go to here chain rotation like this go to 5k frames again make keyframe. frame go to here change zero select keyframes, frames make easy ease let's see okay that's good so go to here and select this body hold shift press p make new position keyframe, frame and go to here let's move to down body go to here select first shape frame control c control v for bones effect select shape frames make easy ease let's see okay that's good select shape frames control c and go to here control v let's see okay let's hold alt move to right select shape frames control c go to last rotation shape frames control v and select this shape frame move to here let's see okay nice so select shape frames hold alt move to left for fast animation and this hold alt move to left and in this time select this here and go to here make rotation shape frame go to last shape frame chain rotation like this okay and go to here make rotation again go to 5k frames chain rotation like this okay and in this time again make keyframe. frame go to here and let's look down select keyframes, frames make easy ease and open heat composition let's select this white control default duplicate select this black let's move to inside white layers and if you not see here click toggle switch mode change none to alpha matte white 2 and select this white 2 link to white and select white press s click this icon for character eyes close animation nice go to here make scale shape frame and go 3 shape frame 1 to 3 change scale 5 go to 3 shape frame again 1 to 3 change 100 select shape frames make easy ease and let's select work area 6 seconds press n and select shape frames control c and let's make control v paste for random ice animation let's see nice so select this black this eyeball and let's move to down let's see here okay and in this time press p make new passing shape frame go to two shape frame one two let's move to right and go to here make new passing shape frame go to two shape frame again one two move to left go to here make new passing shape frame and go to shape frame move to right again Select key frames, control C, go to here, make new passing key frame, control V. Let's see. Okay, not bad. Let's select this key frame, move to here, and this move to here, and this, and this move to right. Okay, let's close this conversation. Let's see. So, thank you for watching my video, and don't forget to subscribe channel, like video, and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck.